Namaste. Today we are going to do Chitra Chaitra Masa Amavasya Meditation. This meditation is part of a series of spiritual karmic healing meditations. All these meditations are supposed to be done in the days of new moon and full moon according to the Indian lunar maps. You can do this meditation every year. Every year they are going to be quite different. <laughs> so let's sit comfortably and easily. If you need to, Adjust something in your posture or in the environment so that you can be easy and comfortable during this meditation. You can do it right now. Let's chant Om to start. Om. Om. Let's become aware of our breath. Let's become aware of the sounds and temperature around us. Let's dive into our breath, observing its temperature, length, rhythm.
Take a breath in. And out. Let's become aware of the thoughts, emotions, sensations, feelings. Everything that is passing through the system. During this meditation, there might be some occurrence in our thoughts, memories, feelings, and sensations. It's natural. Let's observe them. Let's bring awareness to what is coming. And let this awareness just be over any impression that come. After some time, the impression naturally will flow. Because time is flowing. When we allow the impressions to come and we allow the impressions to leave and in the middle we bring awareness, the stress relief is achieved. Let's practice this and see if it's true by your own experience. In the previous meditation, we were accepting and establishing ourselves in the path of service. The service to the family on one side. And the service for society on the other side. Both of these servers are complementary, just like when we cycle in the bicycle, one feet is doing 80% of the activity in a moment and the other is just doing 20%. In this life, either through family, either through society, We need to choose the path that we are going to put our 
80% effort in that side. And now we are going to start today's journey. Om. Let's become aware of a peace of wood in the earth. After some time, this piece of wood gets burned into the ground. With some special conditions, the pressure of the earth around this wood starts to compress. The wood into a more denser material. more and more weight over this wood creates more and more pressure. Let's increase the pressure over our efforts. So that wood can harden into diamond. Let's open ourselves to this stressful action. Maybe some emotions can start to appear. But let the emotions come. The feelings, the thoughts, sensations and memories. Welcome them. Swagatam. in our lives after we have chosen the path. We need to harden ourselves to be able to stand to the stresses of life. These stresses can be 
from our job, from our family, from our institution, from our friends, from our city, from our society, from our health, from our finances. But surely, they will be there. In this moment, more than welcoming them, we are acknowledging the importance of stress so that we can harden our wood into diamond Gently and softly. Let's bring attention to any memory where we were profoundly, stressfully compressed. Those moments in life that we were almost giving up because it was so much stressful, so deeply stressful, that we, we thought, oh, I need to quit this job. I need to quit this family. I need to quit this city. I need to quit even this life. Please allow your mind to experience the memory of that stress. Keep observing the sensations, the feelings, and the thoughts, and the emotions that might be coming. And save yourself in the observation of the breath. The emotions are being felt in one level. And the awareness is anchoring our presence beyond these mental occurrences.
if already the stress is gone we can bring another memory of a highly stressful situation in our lives if the previous one is still very big just be with it a little bit more bring the emotional mind into this hurricane of emotions let the hurricane the tsunami the earthquake completely shake again the emotions the feelings the thoughts and sensations throw the emotional mind into this hell of despair do it here where the awareness can anchor you in the breath all your spiritual journey is being compressed and heated so that you can become a diamond in this existence please be brave cross the sea of the sirens cross the hell of memories anchoring the presence in the breath observe the emotional mind bring attention to it and let the presence of awareness envelop this stress If these two rounds of stressful diving already were too much to stand right now, please lay down, cover yourself if appropriate, and rest. If you're fine in this moment, just with a little of punch here and there, let's invite once again the storm of emotions.
グリーンでプレゼンス To a very stressful situation in this life or in other lives. Let us be more feeling than understanding. Just the feeling. Of a huge compression of stress all around us. A huge pressure, a huge temperature, stressing the carbon into diamond. Let the emotions be tested. Let the awareness anchor the presence in the breath. Heavier. Hotter, denser, more and more pressure over our emotional body, compressing just like you're going to die. This very Moment. Observe the breath. See the changes. And observing again the breath. See what's happening with the changes. That the awareness over the breath brings. Just like when you dive into deep waters. The pressures in your ears increase. Learn the technique of the breath. Bring attention to the breath and keep an eye in the emotional body. If there is any need to cry or to shout or to lay down, please let it flow.
gently and softly. Let's wind up this surgery. All that has had to be purged from the system is now properly cleaned, cleansed. The amount of stress that was to be liberated in this meditation today is now done. Slowly and gradually, the emotional body now is going to start to reconstitute its shape so we can come back to our senses. A huge hole in the emotional body is cleansed and uh, with a lot of love, with a lot of grace, layer by layer. This cavern is now going to be filled and reconstituted. If it's easier for you, there can be light feeling, there can be water feeling up, there can be grace feeling up, love. Whatever it feels natural to you, bring this remedy to the place where there was filth and now there is an empty space. Fulfill this space with any divine presence.
like a lotus closing itself. The emotional body is now closing its membranes, its petals. After this surgery in our emotional body, if possible, today, if you're going to sleep now, if you're going to be awake and now, See if it's possible that you stay a little bit easier and lighter for the next three hours, six hours, two days. If possible, stay apart from any kind of discussions, if possible. Now, our emotional body is already packed back into a deeper layer of consciousness and our emotional mind is detached from its intense perception. If you're all right and you want to stay seated, you can continue. If you feel better to lay down for the mantra, Only check if the temperature where you're laying down and over you, it's appropriate.
Shiva. If I... Shiva. Shiva.
Slowly and gradually. Hmm. Let's become aware of our body and surrounding. The temperature, the sound. We are now restoring our minds to the external 
range of presence. If you feel that it's important for you to stay more time resting, please do so. If you wish to stay meditating also, you can. If you're ready, traveling with us in this series, please remember to stop the uh, automatic reproduction prior to the meditation when you see the warning. So in this moment, you can just be. If you did not do so, you can just now close the computer or the cell phone or whatever, if you wish to stay more in your own time. Hmm. If you're fine, you can roll to one side, to the left. Roll to the other side, to the right. Ah. And stay in a fueto position for more one, two, three, four, five minutes. You're seated and you wish to bring back your senses to the external world, you can warm a little bit your the palms of your hands with kindness and bring them close to the eyes, close to the ears. Close to the uh, cheeks, close to the neck, and with uh, one, two inches distance, you can wash your face with this pranic glancing around your head, bringing the Pranic flow back to the head. Namaste. Thanks for joining this meditation. If this meditation was helpful for you and you want to share it, share it with somebody, please do so.